Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. This video is about colposcopy. When we do pap smear and we find out the dyskaryotic changes on pap smear, then the next step in cervical screening program is that of the colposcopy. And you can find the links of pap smear and cervical screening program by clicking on the i button in the top right corner of this video. What is colposcopy? Colposcopy is an outpatient procedure that examines the lower adenogenital tract with binocular microscope. It involves the 60 to 40 time magnified visualization of transformation zone of the cervix. What is the goal of colposcopy? Colposcopy is a clinical gold standard test for evaluation of patients with abnormal cervical cytology. What are the indications of colposcopy? Colposcopy is done both for diagnostic and therapeutic purposes. The diagnostic indications include first of all postmenopausal bleeding, secondly postcoital bleeding, thirdly cytological abnormality on the pap smear, abnormal bleeding of the cervix, preoperative assessment in early staging of the CA cervix. Therapeutic indications include First of all, for cervical biopsy because it helps in direct visualizing of the abnormal area of the cervix. Secondly, it helps in follow-up in conservative management. Let us talk about preparation of the patient before the procedure. Prior to examination, a woman's medical record including gynecologic and dysplasia histories should be reviewed to make sure that there is legitimate indication for the procedure. Step number one. Full visualization of the cervix, squamocolumnar junction. Step number two, application of solutions like normal saline, acetic acid of 3 to 5 percent, Lugol iodine solution. After application of each of these solutions every time, the cervical changes are visualized by using the colposcopy. What is the role of normal saline in colposcopy? Normal saline helps remove the cervical mucus and allows the initial assessment of the vascular pattern on the cervix along with the surface contour assessment. What is the role of acetic acid in colposcopy? About 3 to 5 percent of acetic acid is taken by the neoplastic cells that result in acetovite changes abnormal cells appearance on acetic acid application. Acetic acid application coagulates protein and stain abnormal cells white. Squamous metaplasia appear glossy white on application of acetic acid. What is the role of Lugol iodine in colposcopy? Application of Lugol iodine in colposcopy is called Schiller's test. Normal cell appearance on the Schiller test. Normal cells stain brown in the Schiller test as they stain with Lugol iodine. Abnormal cell appearance on the Schiller test with Lugol iodine, the mature squamous cells rich in glycogen stain dark brown and dysplastic cells or glycogen deficient neoplastic cells fail to stain and appear with a various shade of yellow color. Stage number three. In stage 3 of the colposcopy procedure, we do grading of the lesions. First of all, we check lesion margin and color and we find out first of all acetovitening like leukoplakia. White areas of the thickened epithelium are there. Secondly, we find out condylomatous changes like frond-like changes, micropapillary, feathery and satellite lesions. When we check for the lesion vascular pattern, we find out certain punctations, mosaicism, and atypical vessels. Stage number four, direct punch biopsy to gain histological confirmation or definitive treatment. That is stage four. Clinical colposcopic index or scoring system is also very important. When we say that the score is 0 to 2, it means there are insignificant lesions. When the score is 3 to 5, there is mixed pattern histology with tendency of lesion from sin 1 or 2. When the score is 6 to 10, means high grade lesions, sin 3. 
types of biopsy while doing colposcopy. If the transformation zone is fully visualized, biopsy of the worst atypical epithelium may be undertaken with excisional method like with a laser or diathermy. When a large portion of the cervix for histological examination is required, go for loop biopsy. If transformation zone is not fully visualized, then the punch biopsy is not possible in, in such situation. So cone biopsy or external uh, diathermy loop is recommended in such situations. So thank you so much. That was all about colposcopy. Allah Hafiz. Subscribe on Ops and Gynae.